Right, so what are we watching for tonight? The big show starts at four o'clock our time. It feels early, but that's when polls close in six states in our country, including Georgia, some of Florida and Virginia. If Joe Biden flips Georgia, it could mean a very good sign for the Democrats at the start of the night. A half hour later after that, 430 our time, you've got Ohio, North Carolina. Everybody's going to be watching those two states because if Joe Biden wins any or all of these states, Ohio in particularly, there is definitely a path for him to victory. 5 p.m. West Coast time. Polls close in 16 more states. 5 o'clock our time is a big time for this election. You've got Florida and Pennsylvania. Florida is seen as a make or break state for both sides. If Joe Biden wins Florida, it is going to be a tough road for the president. 6 p.m. tonight, votes are counted in most of the other battleground states. Arizona, you've heard all about Michigan, Wisconsin, Nebraska, Arizona. Interesting point for you. By law, Pennsylvania and Michigan don't start counting votes until later this morning. So if there are any voting issues in those states, that's what could force this count into tomorrow and late into the night. But at 6 p.m. tonight, we could see a clear winner depending on how things go with this election. Then at 7 o'clock our time, Iowa gets into the mix. Iowa is a very interesting state. It went Obama, Biden, Trump, Pence. Everyone's going to be watching to see the metrics on that race. And then on the West Coast tonight, 8 o'clock our time, of course, our polls close. We get our results along along with Idaho, Oregon, and California. Not going to make much of a difference when it comes to the swing states, but a big difference when it comes to that final popular vote tally. Lots to watch for tonight, me.